There's been some big visible progress on the FM Airy Diversion Project this past month. I'm Tom Fuchs, Senior Construction Manager for the Metro Flood Diversion Authority, and I'm here with an update on the work being done. Crews at the Wild Rice River structure near Horace, North Dakota have completed gate assembly on site and installed trunnion hubs and radial arms in the second of the structure's two bays. The gates were manufactured in Alabama, pre-assembled for dimension checks, and then disassembled for delivery earlier this summer. It took a handful of transport trucks to move each gate to the site. All that effort culminated this week when the first gate was installed in its final position. The single gate weighs about 140,000 pounds, roughly as much as 10 elephants, and stands just over 40 feet tall. Seeing it in place is a much anticipated milestone in the project, and we are looking forward to seeing more gates installed in the coming months. That's not the only work that was done at the Wild Race River site though. Ames Construction, the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers contractor there, also started building a temporary bridge across the Wild Race River that they will use for accessing the east side of the site and constructing tie-ins to the 20 mile long southern embankment. They are also working on constructing concrete approach aprons on the upstream side of the structure and are nearly done building the west flood walls. Nearby at the I-29 Road Raise Project, Industrial Builders, another Army Corps of Engineers contractor, was able to reopen the intersection of County Roads 18 and 81 to traffic. Work is wrapping up on the County Road 18 interchange, which will reopen to the public soon as well. Crews are paving the southbound lanes of I-29 and construction is continuing at the Borrow Ditch Bridges. Bridge girders are being installed on the southbound bridge and foundation work has now begun on the northbound bridge. Want progress updates on our other construction sites? Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn.